How to change cat food. Cats have different nutritional requirements depending on their age and health. It is important to adjust their food when they mature and during the aging process. At the same time, you should avoid changing your cat's food too quickly because they can get sick. Cats love the routine of having the same food every day, so you should give them time and a nurturing environment whenever you need to change their diet. 1. Scheduling the transition. Pick cat food based on life stage. The nutritional needs of your cat will change as they grow and age, so you should change their food when they are making a life transition. If your kitten is becoming a cat or your adult cat is becoming a senior, you should choose a food that is appropriate for their new stage of life. Depending on their health and preferences, you may also want to switch between brands of cat food or between dry and wet varieties of food. Mix the old with the new food. Instead of suddenly changing your cat's food, you should mix their old with their new food. Continue to serve the same size portions but include some new food mixed into the old recipe, so that your cat gradually gets used to the new taste. Gradually increase the amount of new food you give your cat. Follow a 7-day transition schedule. The first rule of transitioning to a new food is to do it slowly. Gradually mix more new food into your cat's regular, old diet. You could try the following 7-day transition schedule. From day 1 to 2, give your cat 1 quarter new food and 3 quarters old food. During days 3 and 4, give your cat half new food and half old food. From day 5 to 6, give your cat 3 quarters new food and 1 quarter old food. On day 7, give your cat a portion of entirely new food. Use a 10-day transition for older cats. Cats older than 9 years of age are considered senior. From day 1 to 3, feed your cat a portion consisting of 3 quarters old food and 1 quarter new food. From day 4 to 5, give your cat a portion with 50% old food and 50% new food. Watch for signs of difficulty such as an upset stomach. If your cat is having trouble, go back to the formula for days 1 to 3 for a few days and then continue with the schedule. From day 6 to 9, feed your cat a portion containing 3 quarters old food and 1 quarter new food. On day 10, give your cat only the new food. Look for signs of difficulty and adjust accordingly. During the transition process, look for signs that your cat is having trouble with the new food. If they are experiencing any minor symptoms, you should give them a longer period to adjust to the new food. However, if the symptoms look serious, you should take them to the veterinarian. Look for the following symptoms. Soft stool. Vomiting. Diarrhea. Loss of appetite. 